Captain Jatin Baines with Space Eyes. Uh, we're based in Philadelphia, United States, and our core competency is in maritime domain understanding, uh, which includes two skill sets, uh, which is maritime situation awareness and maritime domain awareness. We are involved in a very unique project where our company, along with the government of UK, government of India, Israel, and the government of Australia are participating in a radar satellite that will be performing the bulk of its operational activity over the Indo-Pacific with a focus on asymmetric threats. The important thing is that today the warfighter commanders, they need to go from collection to analytics to visualization in a time compressed period because the threats are emanating faster and faster. So what we hope to accomplish over here is create this project where we're able to have agile development of software simultaneously leverage the capacity that the partners bring together and then we're able to help the warfighter address the concerns. The concerns of the Indo-Pacific are substantial. Uh, if you see just the uh, monsoon period, during the monsoon periods, there are weeks and weeks where it's very difficult to get uh, area situational awareness. And by using satellites, we're able to be a force multiplier for the traditional intelligence reconnaissance and surveillance capabilities, namely the marine patrol aircraft. The Indian government is now, uh, has a program to increase the number of marine patrol aircraft but meanwhile, the sat, uh, Novasar satellite can be a force multiplier for the government. It helps the Indian government, it helps the US government, it helps the Australian government, and uh, it has been sponsored by the UK government. So uh, with that, I'd like to uh, finish off by saying that it's a great project, it's gonna have a lot of success, and this is the first of seven satellites. So there'll be much uh, progress to report in the coming months. Thank you.